Hello. Hello, everybody. We just can't escape the Pokemon fever. So, I decided, since I wanted to play even more Pokemon, I'm going to play yet another Pokemon game that I have never played before. Pokemon Crystal. Pokemon Gold was the game I played from this generation. But I didn't even really know that Pokemon Crystal existed. It was kind of like one of those... Like, I knew that Pokemon Yellow existed far more than Pokemon Crystal. It was just kind of that one that I heard about. A little bit. In whispers. So, hey. Screw it. Let's play Pokemon Crystal. And then I also managed to get Pokemon uh, Snap working. Obviously on an emulator. So I'm gonna have to... Maybe I'll play that because I jostled around with that a little bit and it's fun. I should have gone to the... Should have gone to the test. Now do I want to be boy or girl? Because now this is the first time. It's the, it's the first true question of this. And thus a meme was born. I do find it funny that people commonly associate this with like Professor Oak. When he doesn't actually ask you it in the original games. Eh, yeah, screw it. First time they added girl. Let's play girl. I think it knows. It's like, oh really? I don't think it likes being lied to. Hmm? What? You woke me up! Will you check the clock for me? What time is it? Alright. I just kind of realized that these will be perpetually at night. Five. Five o'clock? Yes. How many minutes? Forty-four. I could have lied, but meh. Forty-four. Whoa! Forty-four minutes?! Day five, uh, 5.44. Yikes, I overslept. Really? I wonder what happens if you put it... Oh, hey, it is Professor Oak. So I guess I was wrong. You'd think that... I guess because they figured people are associate Professor Oak with Pokemon professors. They're like, hey, let's have him ask it. So I was wrong. The memes were correct. I am horrific. Hello there. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited by creatures that we call Pokemon. People and Pokemon live together by supporting each other. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them. Others play with them in contact contests, but we, we don't have time to cover that. <laughs> but we don't know everything about Pokemon yet. There are still many mysteries to solve. That's why I study Pokemon every day. Now, what did you say your name was? I shall give myself a new name. My name. The greatest name. My name. Neon, are you ready? Your very own Pokemon story is about to unfold. You'll face fun times and tough challenges. A world of dreams and adventures. With Pokemon await, let's go. I'll be seeing you later. All right, a bit more. Feels a bit more controlly with uh, the turning, it feels like. I want to go back in bed. I turned on the PC. Let's see, can I withdraw an item? There are no items. Oh, I got a mailbox. There's no mail. <laughs> I checked my messages, but there hasn't been any messages. Professor Oak's Pokemon Talk. Please tune in next time. Pokemon Channel. This is DJ Mary, your co-host. Pokemon, Pokemon Channel. That didn't make much sense at all. Ooh. Contains items, your own status, save your progress. Battle, yes. Shift. Sure, I'll put on stereo. Darker. Lighter? I'll just have it be normal. <gasps> you can change! Oh! We are at the peak of technology! 
It's magical! <laughs> I actually do like that you can change the frame so much. I'm gonna do that. I check my own status. I have 3,000 Pokebucks! Well, oh, let's see what's on TV. It's a TV. A whole collection of Pokemon picture books. Yeah, I would have them too. It's the town map. Town map? You mean world map? Newbark, Cherry Grove, Violet, Ruins, uh, Ruins of Alf, Union Cave. Not the Onion Cave. Oh, we do What? Is there no, uh... Huh. There's no video game console. Here I thought they were ubiquitous. Ubiquitous with the entire everything. Oh, Neon. Our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted you to do something for him. Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear is back from the repair shop. Here you go. Pokey gear! Now, if only my internet could be sent and fixed at that repair shop. Jesus Christ. Pokemon gear, or just Pokey gear, is essential if you want to be a good trainer. Oh, the day of the week isn't set. You mustn't forget that. What day is it? What day is it? Sunday. <laughs> Sunday, is it? Is it daylight savings time? No. <laughs> Hello, BLT. I've decided to play Pokemon. I'm setting my time. It gives me anxiety. <laughs> I'm like... It's not daylight savings time, is it? <laughs> is that okay? Sure. Come home to adjust your clock for daylight savings time. By the way, do you know how to use the phone? I'm gonna say no, just in case. I'll read the instructions. Turn the pokey gear on and select the phone icon. Phone numbers are stored in memory. Just choose a name and you want to call. Gee, isn't that convenient? There's a movie on TV. Stars dot the skies. Two boys ride on a train. I better get rolling, too. Hello, Neon. I'm visiting. Neon, have you heard? My daughter is adamant about becoming Professor Elm's assistant. She really loves Pokemon. They are setting up the false prophet. They think, oh, you're going to, they're going to be your, your enemy. No. Let's see what's in the fridge. Fresh water and lemonade. I don't get them. Mom's specialty, Cinnabar Volcano Burger. That actually sounds super good. God damn it, I want it now. The sink is spotless. Mom likes it clean. But I guess as we walk out into the world, I guess maybe I should check out my Pokey Gear. Trainer's key device. Just, yeah, nothing much. Very cool. I was going to say a thing, but I completely forget now. Yo, Neon, I heard Professor Elm discovered some new Pokemon. How dare you get in my way. I was going to say a thing, but I completely forget. Your Poke Gear is so impressive. Did your mom get it for you? That sounds like an insult, even though it's probably a compliment. The town where the winds of a new beginning blow. But yeah. Oh yeah, I've been drawing. Well, that's nice. Uh, I'm just trying to think of things to say, but I'm enraptured by this game. Elm Pokemon Lab. With new Thief installation. So this is the famous Elm Pokemon Lab. What are you staring at? He kicks me out! What an asshole! It's like, I, I came in with topics I wanted to talk about, and now it's purely gone. I'm here. Dang it. Pikachu is an evolved Pokemon. I was amazed by Professor Elm's findings. He's so famous for his research on Pokemon evolution. Uh, I wish I could be a researcher like him. You can! Follow your dreams! It's a TV. Ah, uh, we don't even- we're not gonna see what they're watching. Hi, Neon. My husband's always so busy. I hope he's okay. When he's caught up in his Pokemon research, he even forgets to eat. That is relatable. When I grow up, I'm going to help my dad. I'm going to be a great Pokemon professor. Whatever you say, small child. You'll probably be eaten by a legendary Pokemon. Or stabbed by Rayquaza. Neon, there you are. I needed to ask you a favor. I'm conducting a new research po uh, for Pokemon right now. I was wondering if you could help me with it, Neon. You see, I'm writing a paper that I want to present at the conference. But there are some things I don't quite understand. So, I'd like you to raise a Pokemon that I recently caught. 
Who would ever say no? Except just to be tr contrarian. Thanks, Neon. You're a great help. When I announce my findings, I'm sure we'll delve a bit deeper into the many mysteries of Pokemon. You can count on it. Oh, hey, I got an email. Hmm, uh-huh, okay. Hey, listen. Hey, listen. Oh no, we're playing Zelda now. I have an acquaintance called Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyway, I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It is intriguing, but we're busy with our Pokemon research. Wait, I know. Neon, can you go in our place? I want you to raise one of the Pokemon containing if in these balls. You'll be that Pokemon's first partner, Neon. Go on, pick one. Let's see. We have Cyndaquil. You'll take Cyndaquil, the fire Pokemon. Now, I want to look at the others first. Think it over carefully. Your partner is important. Hmm, Totodile. Do you want Totodile, the water Pokemon? No. It's between Cyndaquil and uh, Chikorita. And I don't know which to choose. What if I choose the trash? <laughs> the wrapper from the snack, Professor Elmate, is in there. <laughs> Guess he doesn't forget to eat as much as you think, Mrs. Elm. I will go Cyndaquil. Try something new. I shall take Cyndaquil. I think that's a great Pokemon, too. Yay! Give a nickname to Cyndaquil you received? Sure! Let's see. What name should you be? I know. That was a big bang. I think people are still blowing up their... Well, actually... With the coronavirus, the corona... No, I was like, ah, dang it, I forgot the actual thing. My brain is going to five million miles per hour. It was fire-related, fire related, and it kind of rhymes with corona. But it was something else. My brain is dying like my internet... I guess, I know, new name that I can't easily mess up. Maha. And plus it might help my internet. Hotspot. No, no. Come with me, Hotspot. We shall rule the world. Mr. Pokemon. <clears throat> Mr. Pokemon lives a little bit beyond Cherry Grove, the next city over. It's almost a direct route. Route to there, so you can't miss it. But just in case... Here's my phone number. Call me if anything comes up. I got Elm's phone number. Now that's just highly unrealistic. If your Pokemon is hurt, you should heal it with this machine. Feel free to use it any time. Neon, I'm counting on you. We shall invade. Ah, you can just heal Pokemon. My reflection. Looking good. I wonder where the window actually is that the dude is looking into. Neon, I want you to have this for your errand. Free potion. There are only two of us, so we're always busy. And now, I can look at my Pokemon. It's holding an item. Huh. Let's go to stats. See if we can actually learn things. Knows Tackle and Leer. I guess, uh, oh, I forgot the main thing. I was going to look and see if I can see the item it's holding here. Nope, it doesn't seem to actually tell you. So you have to take Berry. I will give the Berry back. I just wanted to know what it was. Would be kind of funny if you could just give it a potion. Be a wizard, Hotspot. You just say that again and again. Quit kicking me. I shall see what my parent has to say about this. What's this? <laughs> I'm famous! It's labeled and everything! 
So, what was Professor Elm's errand? That does sound challenging, but you should uh, be proud that people rely on you. But I guess as we go on our adventure, I've been getting... Ooh, that's cool. I've been getting a Pokemon Snap to work, so I might play that. You want to fight me? Pokemon hide in the grass. Who knows when they'll pop out? Wait, there's a small tree. Nope, oh, there's a lot of small trees. I was interested. I thought it was a thing. It was not. <laughs> Dim good eight color graphics. The greatest eight color graphics. Hello, person. Are you gonna fight me? How are your Pokemon? If they're weak and not ready for battle, keep out of the grass. And then there's one, a tree. Already, this place is confusing. It's a Pidgey! Ooh, they actually move! But mine didn't move. Tackle it! Dang it, Hotspot, I relied on you! This is like that battle with the Eevee and Yellow all over again. Except I got the critical hit this time. God, that's scary. We get an experience block! I'm so happy. I found another potion! Yay! But yeah, basically, as we walk about, I've been doing experiments, trying to do things, uploading all the videos to the VOD channel. I forgot that you exist. You evolve into Furret, I think. But, yeah. Been uploading the VODs to the VOD channel. <laughs> now with color! Yeah, now with color. My defeat, my pain and misery. In color. <laughs> my beloved hotspot. Bring me internet. But, I've also been drawing more. Utilizing Clip Studio Paint's ability to import 3D models into it a bit more. It's a bit of a challenge, but hey, I'm also getting Blender practice in. But I'm also trying to not fall into a bad habit of just tracing the models. <laughs> the XP bar is so satisfying. <laughs> you need one. Ferret beckons. Probably do. And now all the sprites actually look on, <laughs> on model. The sprites look on model. It's fantastic. Also, I find it funny that they give Cyndaquil, the Pokemon with their eyes perpetually closed, the leer a bit. Oh, it used to berry! Yay! Good job. But yeah, probably try and get a Furret, unless Furret is like, or a uh, Sintret is super rare. It's just like, you killed the rare one. Okay, just immediately got smokescreen, yay. And now it's already night. <laughs> because I only play in the evening. I wanted to take a break, so I saved to my, my to record my progress. Different kinds of Pokemon appear past here. If you want to catch them all, you have to look everywhere. You can't climb ledges, but you can jump the, down from them to take a shortcut. Let's see. Diddly -dee. I think I covered Pokemon Snap. I'm going to probably play that sometime. Because I actually played a little bit. It's actually quite fun. After all these years of me not playing them. <laughs> so many... <laughs> fucking... <laughs> so many, many ledge tutorials. Gimme berry. I'm waiting for Pokemon that appear only in the morning. And I can give a berry to my Pokemon. That's the one downside of streaming in the evening. It's going to be perpetually nighttime <laughs> when I play Pokemon. Granted, I could have fudged the numbers, and I think... I'm unsure if you can change the clock once you set it. Eh. Ooh, a Hoot Hoot. Generation 2 has a lot of good starting Pokemon. How dare you? Also, the animation's gotten so much smoother. 
Like, for the attacks. Not tackle, obviously, but... Like, the growl, it actually is, like, much more anim... Like, or much better animated. Compared to Generation 1. Granted, I think this is when Nintendo's... <laughs> I think after the success of Pokemon Blue... Because I think that's the thing that I read, that... Pokemon Green and Red weren't straight-out bang successful. But they were consistent. They got a much more consistent sales over their lifetime, and then Blue kind of took off. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay, everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Sure, old man. Okay, then, follow me. This is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. This is a Pokemart. They sell balls for catching wild Pokemon and other useful things. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their prized Pokemon there. This is the sea. As you can see, some Pokemon are found only in the water. This is my home. Goodbye. Here, it's my house. Thank you for a company. Let me give you a small gift. Map card. Now I can finally know where I'm going. Pokegear becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Guide. He's uh, he's known as the guide gent. When I get older, I'm going to be a gym leader. I make my Pokemon battle with my friends to make them tougher. If you're trying to see how good you are as a Pokemon trainer, you better visit the Pokemon gyms all over Johto and collect badges. I like that there's actually color. Oak's Pokemon talk. Professor Oak's. <laughs> I'm not sure if that. I'm. I don't know what happened. Mr. Pokemon's house is still further up ahead. It's like they know. Everyone knows. When you're po walking Pokemon, going anywhere is fun. Except I can't walk my Pokemon until Soul Silver. Pokemon gain experience in battle and change their form. I'm telling this to the person here. Pokemon change? I would be shocked if one did that. Well, let's go ahead and talk to people. The communication center upstairs is just built, but they're still finishing it up. It's great that I can store any number of Pokemon and it's all free. That PC is free for any trainer to use. Oh, they don't even have a chancy anymore. Good evening, you're out late. How dare you judge me. I'm so I'm a streamer. How dare you? I can't believe Pokemon is judging my my life. That definitely felt faster than the normal. When I was walking in the grass, a bug Pokemon poisoned my Pokemon. I just kept going, but then my Pokemon fainted. You should keep Antidote with you. And... Pokemon Center. They're fresh out of Pokeballs! When will they get more of them? Well, that, that, that ruins my point of coming here. Goodbye. I leave. More combat, more fighting, more hoots. Go, Hutchpot. Leer at him. <laughs> Apparently with laser beams. With lasers! That'll make Leer so much more fun. And note to self, keep Hotspot his, uh, <laughs> as is for quite a while until he learns all the, the moves early. Route 30, Violet City to Cherry Grove. But where's the Pokemon house? I'm gonna steal your fucking berry. Your berry's mine, old man. You know Pokemon eat berries. Well, my Pokemon got healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. I'm just taking all the berries ever. All the berries are mine. And berry isn't even the rival here yet. 
He's not until Sinnoh. Oh yeah, that's another thing. I pre-ordered Pokemon Arceus because I still had a IOU uh, Christmas gift for uh, 50. Mr. Pokemon's house? It's a bit further ahead. And I decided, you know, like, I could have gotten things on, like, uh, <laughs> straight ahead. Ah, that's nice. But I could have gotten a bunch of games on Steam, but none of them really spoke to me. Whereas I'm like, could just be... Oh yeah, we, there's... Oh yeah, different Pokemon appear at different times. Oh god. We're gonna run into the same Pokemon over and over again. Maybe I should alt... Then again, I could probably speed up time. And offset the clock. Maybe. It's not very effective. <laughs> we'll just have to wait and see how I want to handle the time thing. But that... Yeah, uh, for whatever reason, just like nothing on my uh, that was on sale on my wish list on Steam really spoke to me, so I decided, eh, screw it, I'll I'll pre-order Pokemon Arceus because I've been I've been bitten by the Pokemon fever, much like this Zubat is trying to eat my Cyndaquil. Leave him alone. What is he even based off of? A mole? He's a fire mole. He's a hot boy. They very much made the terrain different in this game. Oh, that's why Hoot Hoot came out, because it turned six. Me dumb. Leer at him. Say, hey, hot stuff, you wanna fight? Apparently, <laughs> apparently he's just very angry. Well, hopefully... Again, I have to ask, I wonder what the conversion rate of Growls to Leer is. Is Does Leer offset uh, the Growl, or does the Growl win out in the end? Who is the victor? Who is the mime? Who is the victor mime? Of course you'd miss. How dare you? I trusted you, my boy. I trusted you to murder. We might have to... Um, nah. I think there's a limit to how much growl can work. That's another thing. Yay, berry time! I'll have to look and see if I can glean more information from the moves. If it'll actually say. Oh, that's a lot of experience. Yum yum. Well, let's take this opportunity to look now. And... Give my boy another berry. And stats. Nope, we can't actually look at the moves. That's a disappointment. So we're still kind of stuck in what the moves do. It's a fruit bearing tree. Poison cure berry. I've never heard of a poison cure berry before. Is it like boysenberry? <laughs> what even is boysenberry? Hello, hello! You must be Neon! Professor Elm said that you would visit. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. Mystery egg! I know a couple who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For Pokemon evolution, Professor Elm is the authority. Even Professor Oak here recognizes that. <laughs> I like that he kind of looks over and just like, Say it against my face, you bitch. If my assumption is correct, Professor Elm will know it. Aha! So, you're Neon. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Uh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. To researchers like Professor Elm and I, Pokemon are our friends. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See? This is the latest version of the Pokédex. It automatically records data on Pokémon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Even though in the original... In fact, I think in the original it actually was just a pen and paper encyclopedia. Go meet many kinds of Pokémon and complete that Pokédex. 
but I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Neon, I'm counting on you. You're returning to Professor Elm. Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. I inject rest right into your neck. It's like heroin. I'm depending on you. What's this? Oh, I can't look outside the table. Push the table. Whole pile of strange coins. Maybe they're from another country. That's a computer keyboard. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> it's packed with foreign magazines. Can't even read their titles. It's packed with foreign magazines. God, I just love Pokemon. Professor Realm is calling. Hello? Neon, it's a disaster! Uh, um, it's, it's just terrible. What should I do? Oh, no. Please, get back here now! Well, obviously, he's a terrible professor. He can't even beat up a child. I could, I could fight Professor Elm. I could win. Another hoot hoot. We'll go ahead and beat him up. Gotta level up our Pokemon. And now I don't have to worry anymore. Pokemon Critical Hit Edition is over. Now it's Pokemon Normal. Wow, you did no damage. Holy shit, you, you suck. <laughs> Never mind. Right as I say, it's not Critical Hit Edition anymore. I get a critical hit. I think the, that the game is telling me, uh -huh. <sighs> Try your luck, white boy. <laughs> and I think I'm going to heed. <laughs> I think I'm going to shut up. Do they have Pokeballs yet? They're fresh out of Pokeballs. Well, obviously, we just have to make them out of pine cones, you know, like they're gonna do in the ancient land of Sinnoh. That's not called Sinnoh, but I forget what it's called now. Also, I find it funny that the Pokemon healing machine has only gotten bigger since the last time. You got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste. A wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Oh no. We're fighting an asshole. He stole Totodile, my baby boy. Well, fool, I power leveled my Pokemon because I'm the best Pokemon master. I'm gonna leer you. Ah, uh, damn it, he leered back. So you know what I'm gonna do? Smoke screen! <laughs> I'm Batman! And now, kill that faker! He's the new Shadow the Hedge! <laughs> Shadow over the hedge! Well, the accuracy loss hasn't done much. Hope he doesn't get a crit. Please don't crit. Please! And now berry time. Your Pokemon isn't even good. It doesn't know how to use berries. My Pokemon, he's a berry master. Ah, fool! Nothing can stand in my way. Ah, are you happy you won? Well, I'm happy to take $300. My name's question mark, question mark, question mark. I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. He didn't even stop at the Pokemon Center. What an asshole. I'm the win. I should probably go and do, do, do. Give my Pokemon another berry and then, I don't know. Let's see. No, wrong one. Not the Pokedex. The Pokemon. Guess he doesn't need. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah. I must be allergic to assholes like that. That question mark guy. I find it funny that he actually says, "My name's question mark question mark question mark." And then the, ga and then the game doesn't even let us name him. 
I guess that's him telling us his name so that we can relay what his name is to Professor Elm, so I guess it makes sense, but still, it's kind of funny. Ba -ba. And once again, I've just been caught up in the glory of this game that I completely forgot my previous train of thought. Until Heart Gold Soul Silver remakes, the sprite for Silver always looked like they were wearing a skirt. I didn't even think of that. I am unobservant. But as we trudge our way back to Professor Elm, let's see. Yeah, just for whatever reason, I've just been caught up just loving it some, loving me some Pokemon. So I can't wait to play more Pokemon games like Pokemon Snap. Since I got that working, I'm gonna play that. And then uh, Pokemon Arceus, when it comes out and gets here, I'll probably stream it, depending on where it is. It's always one of girl names. Oh, that's why. <laughs> Based off of the sprite and it looking like a skirt. Ah, that makes sense. It's not like Gary. Gary is always Gary. I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just setting, getting some information for Professor Elm. Apparently, it was a young male with long red hair. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? <laughs> Carl! You can't steal Pokemon. Carl! I, I do not steal Pokemon. That is my least favorite thing. Okay, so Carl was his name. Thanks for helping my investigation. Neon, this is horrible. Oh, yes, what was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? Egg. What's this? I like his sharp step back. But is it a Pokemon egg? If it is, it is truly a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? Neon, is that true? That, that's incredible. He's superb at seeing the potential in people as trainers. Oh, well, Neon, you have what it, you have what it takes to be the champion. You seem to be getting on great with Pokemon too. You should take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. The closest gym would be the one in Violet City. Neon, the road to the championship will be a long one. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. Can I take Chikorita with me too, just for safekeeping? Neon, use these on your Pokedex quest. Pokeball! You have to catch Pokemon. Throw Pokeballs at wild Pokemon to get them. And let me guess, I can't get a Sentret at this time of day. This is discriminatory to people who have insomnia. Wow, that's a cute Pokemon. Where did you get it? So, you're leaving on an adventure. Okay, I'll help you too, but what can I do for you? I know I'll save money for you on a long journey. Money is important. Do you want me to take uh to save your money? Yes. Okay, I'll take care of your money. Be careful. Pokémon are your friends. You need to work as a team. Now go. And off I go. But I must I must check my computer to see if I have any emails. And I check my messages. But I don't got any messages. Oh, wrong one. Ah! Kind, of, kind of annoying that it resets the cursor. Nope, no items. I guess they decided nobody checked the computer box in the previous generation. Just shoved the potion into their hand. Hey, it kind of worked. I've seen you a couple of times. How many Pokemon have you caught? Would you like me to show you how to catch Pokemon? Sure! <laughs> Steps immediately into grass. Gets attacked by Pokemon. I... Ah! That's a, that's a pretty clean sprite from behind. <laughs> Go, Pokeball! <laughs> Go, Potion! I'm gonna head out for a bit. Hopefully I'll get back to catch the rest. If not, have a good stream. See you later, BLT General. Have a good uh, step away. I like, dude caught Pokemon. <laughs> That's how you do it. If you weaken them first, Pokemon are easier to catch. And I doubt Sentra is out at this time of day. I should have fudged the numbers. 
And I'm gonna wait until we get to, like, the level four area before trying to catch Pokemon just because leveling up's a bit of a pain, I fear. Might as well just get a bit of a head start. Since it seems to be basically the same Pokemon pool, it doesn't seem like that big a hullabaloo. But what else? I'm thinking of things. Yeah, overall, just been trying to draw more. It's just like things. I also kind of want to do more writing, but then that would get in the way of my drawing. And what I need to do is get back on the bandwagon of trying to learn Live 2D. But then I got into the thing of, I have to refine my art first, even though I just need to buckle down and make an abomination. Like, come on, it would be super simple, just make an abomination. I guess what I could do, depending on... Because this is emulated, because how else am I supposed to record this? Besides annoying methods. So I guess what I could do is off-screen grab a centret, maybe. And then just try not to level up my dude in that time. Because I don't think I'll need to grind in this game. Uh, we'll have to see. Once again, I could try and fudge the numbers. Make it so that halfway through a stream, it turns to night, <laughs> maybe. That's what I should have done. Damn it. I'm dumb. You can't lower my defense. He is the mighty hotspot, and he crushes you. And let me check this again. It's a fruit bearing tree. There's nothing here. <laughs> There's nothing out there. And of course, Pokemon Centaur. You may have my one Pokemon. My singular Pokemans. <laughs> Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. My singular Pokemans. And now we shall see. Because I think probably Hoot Hoot takes over for Centret at night time. So. I'm not sure if Hoot Hoot is a good Pokemon to catch or not. But it is a Pokemon to catch in the end. And I finally got around to moving my water so I don't have to drink it over my microphone. Alright. Go, Pokeball! If you break out, I'm murdering you on principle. I like that animation! I love that it opened up and then Smith fell. There was something special about... Ah, uh, but what should your name be? It begins to hoot at the same time every day. Some trainers use them in place of clocks. Now, this isn't to be a funny man. It's just that... I want to reference Owl from Winnie the Pooh. Because I got to the 100 Acre Wood in Winnie the Pooh. Did it heal my dude? Did not heal my dude. But I will switch you in and try to heal him up a bit. We'll heal him up and then begin healing up Hoot Hoot. Or uh, training up Hoot Hoot. I got a new Pokemon. Now we just gotta do our good old switch training. On our way to the next town. Also, I never realized, uh, heard the extra instrumentation in this version before. Huh. I think you might be a valuable ally. You already know Bubble. 
You know Bubble? You know Bubble. Hey, a critical hit, yay. Okay, you are definitely coming on the team. I'm not sure, are you a rare encounter in this place? Uh, come with me, small child, if you want to live. Even if you break out, I'm gonna try and catch you even more. Sure. The swirl on Spelly is its inside showing through the skin. It looks clearer after it eats. Ew. And because I want to troll Carl, I'm gonna name it Toto Dial. Just so I can be like, see, Carl, this is a real Toto Dial. At least until it level evolves, but screw it, it's gonna be a funny joke. Totodile is the the real man. He's the real Totodile. Totodile evolves into Feral Gator? Nah. Still, this is the original. This is the true one. <laughs> I didn't even know Polly... Pollywag? Could appear. I just didn't think of it. <laughs> it's very interesting. And now, back on our adventure. Man, I just didn't expect to run into a water type this early. Here we go again. And I can't really bring out... Uh... I can't really bring out Hotspot because you're using Bubble. So that would be, that would be troublesome. And Growl won't work against you either, because you're using a special attack. Wow, Poliwag, you're a jerk. And Hoot Hoots, my poor owl, has a low attack. He can take one more, unless he gets, uh... But still... Totodile, go! Shut up, it's funny! It only knows Bubble. That's hilarious. Time for the fight of the ages! A fight I will inevitably win! And no, I will not use the speed up feature purely because... I deserve this. I have earned this agony. <laughs> Can't stop, won't stop. The bubble train never ends. It is the ultimate. Poliwag versus Totodile. Yes, that is a Totodile. Shut up. That would be hilarious in a giant tournament. And now it's time for Neon and their powerful Totodile sends out a polywag. <laughs> it's Totodile, shut up. It's the one in original. <laughs> this is so stupid, but I would have it no other way. I would have it no other way. Quit setting off fireworks. It is January 2nd. That was the dumbest thing in the world, and I loved it. That was the dumbest thing in the world, and I would not have it any other way. And now I have to go back and heal. <laughs> and I didn't even know. Maybe next time I should just run. Because that takes a while. Because Hoot Hoot has a low attack. Dear God, please have a good special. I'm not going to spoil it for myself. I'm going to wait for him to level up. I mean, I could have tried sending out Hotspot, but I don't know. It only knows Bubble. It only knows Bubble, the horror. 
This makes me wonder, there has to be Pokemon based off of Kappa. Sea turtle monsters that come out of the woodwork to eat children. Hoot Hoot v Hoot Hoot. It is the ultimate Hoot Hoot. Go Owl, use Tackle Attack. Keep up the offense. Yeah, just to speed this up, I'm gonna switch in hotspot. Like, Jesus Christ, stop with the fireworks. I know, you probably bought too many fireworks that are illegal, and now you're like, I gotta get rid of them. Better fire them up into the sky. You fool, you cannot growl at a hot spot, it merely explodes! You know, despite the fact that fireworks are supposed to be illegal, they're really just not, apparently. That's annoying. No, I'm gonna find another polywag. I don't want to suffer it. No! No! <laughs> not the fun not the polywag! No! Run! Can't escape! No! The polywag says no, you must die! Look into my eyes! Help! It's a nightmare. Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. And it'll never end. Please don't get a crit. And now I need to use a potion. I mean, or I could do the stupid thing. Screw it, I'm gonna do the stupid thing because it's technically efficient. <laughs> polywag v polywag violence! <laughs> He's got a critical hit and it only did two damage. Ah! <sighs> oh god, it's getting so many crits. Is this the return of Pokemon the Critical Hit Edition? Why is it that I could not escape? And it's lowering my speed in the process. God. Aye, aye, aye. What have I done? I've locked myself into hell. I should have gotten Chikorita. I should have. Why did I not get Chikorita? This would have solved everything. Well, I, I kind of, I guess, because then Chikorita would have been resistant to bubble. Okay, I got a critical hit now. Yay. Thank God that didn't get any critical hits while it was fighting Owl. That's nice, at least. Totodial will win this ultimate battle of ultimate destiny. And then once we get to a different place, I'll be able to actively do switch training properly. Hopefully. Why do I do this to myself? I don't know. I'm also the type of person that's like, I'm eventually gonna play Kingdom Hearts 358 over two days. Not just watch the recap cutscenes. <laughs> because I'm kind of dumb at times. What magic is this? What magical nightmare? <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. Nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. <laughs> 
At least they level up. Please get a physical attack. Let's see. Your is 11 attack. Fifth, uh, special defense. Yeah, you actually have higher attack than diddly D. Oh, we didn't even see his stats. You're not gonna kill me, are you? Everyone's having fun battling. You should too. Alright. I tried to escape and failed. Let's go back and heal up my Pokemon so we can actually do a Pokemon battle. Owl did level up. No, not you. Oh. He didn't even level up. Dear God, Owl, please. <gasps> my boy. He didn't heal. Or, he didn't level. Alright, so we're gonna backtrack a bit to the last place so we can kill a level 2 Pokemon and level up and then be decent. Because <laughs> I'm not fighting another Poliwag. I probably should have gone Chikorita. But I'm stuck here, and Hotspot is awesome, so screw it. And the Pokemon want my blood. Alright. Now kill the Rattata! Kill the Rattata and level up. If you somehow manage to get one experience point, I will smack you. There you go. Well, yeah, at least you have special defense that's actually decent. I think. I don't know Pokemon stats. Shut up. Let's see. Do, you, do they have Pokeballs yet, my dude? Pokeballs are in stock. Now I can catch Pokemon. Pokemon. Also, a thing that makes me sad that I didn't realize... The Pokey Flute wakes up Pokemon in battle. Profound sadness. Nice to know that Silver, aka Carl, paid for my Pokeballs. Or at least half of them. Does that mean that I owe Carl one and a half Pokeballs? I don't want to own him. Owe him half. Oh, my, 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 my. One and a half Pokeballs. And I shall growl again. Fool, my attack is still higher than yours. Oh god, I don't think it is. Yeah, so it seems that Growl is a one-use thing. Seemingly. Maybe. Well, let's see. Is it even worse? No, nah, it seems about the same. So yeah, this kind of is a nice little test. You can't growl at me multiple times and win. I'm the magic man. From behind it makes it look like Hoot Hoot we wears a little hat. Like a doily on its head. How could you miss? It is a ball with one foot. I get caught too caught up in now's my chance to do thing. Just switch train in Pokemon, like, uh, trainer battles. Just switch train in Poke Bottles. Poke Bottles? Yeah, my, my, my brain is on fire, and I don't know why. It's not even hot, it's just that it's burning. Because obviously some language centers are going bye-bye. Apparently this is the Nightmare Zone. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Well, now you're just begging me to do this, because this one should be easier to kill. Why do I do this to myself? I should just go attack the trainer, but no, I'm just like, But a level 3 Hoot Hoot's here! I can use it for training! Yay, it made the worst decision possible! And once again, I'm just like, I'm just caught by Pokemon fever, and I don't know why. No polywag, no polywag, no polywag. No! Not the polywag! Oh. But I don't think that bug types are good. And I'm not a big bug type fan. Don't you dare, don't you, don't, don't you, don't you, don't, good. Don't, don't poison owl. That's fine to miss, especially miss. Good for you. Just don't, don't poison my boy. Don't poison, I do have a poison berry, but don't poison my boy. Foresight. Can we learn what that move does? I don't think we can still. Move? No, that's actually move. Or is it? We can! Oh, I'm a dumb! It's... Switch and move <laughs> got me confused. But foresight negates accuracy reduction moves. It's actually not that good, but overall, man. Reduces the foe's attack. Ooh, attack power even. Tackle, 35. Let's look at our moves. Because we can look at our moves. A full body charge attack reduces the foe's defense. Lowers the foe's accuracy. That's just, like, a big body move. Bubble. Attack 20. An attack that may reduce enemy speed. Nice. And let's go ahead and save. We don't have any badges yet. But we do have the ability to save. Hey, dude, you want to fight? I just lost, so I'm trying to find more Pokemon. Wait, you look weak. Come on, let's battle. Wow, you sound like an asshole. You also look like you need to sleep. What level's your Radita, boy? Growl. And I don't have to use foresight. I can just tackle you to death. Level up my boy owl. Wow, you missed? How did you... Oh, wait, I missed. Oh, fuck! The point remains... Oh, wait, no. Who missed? I'm dumb. I'm, again, brain on fire! Brain on fire! Ah! Youngster Joey has been defeated! I lost again, doggone it. Uh, sent some to mom. Do I have have more Pokemon in order to battle better? No, I'm sticking with this one no matter what. Listen, can I get your phone number? I'll ring you for some battles. I'm a rookie too, so I think it'd be a good motivator. Sure, youngster Joey. <laughs> I'll ring you whenever I get the urge to battle. <gasps> no! <gasps> wait. Wait. Does that look like a different color of Poliwag? Nope. <laughs> For some reason it looked different. But it isn't. I'm just dumb. I'm just very dumb. Plus it would have had a twinkling effect. Please don't get crits. Even though that would only be four damage, still. Then again, it is a stab attack, but even then. Dibbity D. Ah, bleh, dabbity, dabbity. Critical hit at the end. Lol. 
I'm just obsessed. Obsessed with battling. Obsessed with dueling. Obsessed with beating people to death with my Pokemon. <laughs> Hi there. I'm Brock, the gym leader of Pewter City. I'm gonna beat you to death with a rock. Geodude. Yeah. Wag. No. No! Pony Wah! Oh, it's a spinner egg. I just assume that it's going to be a polywag out of primal fear of everything. Don't you dare poison my poison. Fuck you. Now I'm gonna have to head back. Well, at least they very much, uh, streamlined the pacing of battles this time. That's super nice. Hey, Totodial. Beat up the Spinarak. It's ugly. If you dare poison both my Pokemon, you are the biggest bastard, and now you will die. Drowning in bubbles. I have to go back because now I'm getting flashbanged every step of the way until my Pokemon are dying. Miss Joy! Nurse Joy! My Pokemon have been poisoned by bastard Pokemon. After playing Pokemon Yellow, it's kind of lonely not seeing Pikachu after me. Ah, you long for death. Ah, I long for death. Kill him. At least this one can't poison you. This is the very least. But I really do need to level up. I can't even train my Poliwag here. Because there's too many Poliwags for my Poliwag to fight. And now I shall send out Poliwag. My Totodile. My Totodile Poliwag. To get a little bit of experience in. Sure, they won't be a lot, but it'll be decent. It's the Battle of the Bubbles. No one could see a thing. There were too many bubbles. What is in the bubbles that actually makes them dangerous? Do they explode? Are they high-velocity bubbles that, like, hit you with the, with the, with the, with the, with the power of a bullet? What is the answer? These were obviously used to kill people in the Great Pokemon War, so what's the answer? Now I'm imagining Pokemon waterboarding people. Fun. He needs one to level up! Now that's the greatest joke I've ever heard. Oh, it's a hoot hoot. It's a hoot hoot. Tackle attack. Growl. If. Look at that. That should totally just be a level up automatically. Any person that looks at that is like, yeah, that's a full experience bar. I was gonna hand you off to be eaten by a Totodile, but you decided to commit suicide by Owl. Power through. Let's see, is there anywhere to go up here past the... 
Gotta explore more. And now to do a bit of... Hey, I have a blue Pokeball. Why do I have a blue Pokeball in my sprite? Probably should have used Growl and then Switch, but meh. Smoke screen. And I shall beat you to death with my fiery body. How dare you! And now I shall use laser beams. Laser beams from the fire. Once again, I don't think growling multiple times does all that much, so... You've lost your mind. You... It's like, I can't land a hit, so I will just keep growling. Actually, what you'll do is die. And now I shall throw Totodile into first. So that hot spot can... Do some more switch battling for him. Nope, can't do anything here because we don't have cut. We have that extra instrument that I've never heard before in a Pokemon game. It's super interesting. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Then you have to battle. Why do we have to battle? What is the law of Pokemon battling? Once again, you should probably go to sleep. He sent out a Pidgey. Toto Dial will kill you. Especially because your Pidgey is underleveled. Or at the very least, is. Brand new cotton hasn't fought anything yet. Like, seriously, just get into two fights, kid. You'll probably level up. Bye bye, Pidgey. Pidgey is now dead, and Totodile reigns supreme. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just. Run over this Radita with hot hot shot. Cause hot shot deserves to kill some too. Da -da 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 -da. But it failed! And I'll make sure it continues failing. Smoke screen! I'm Batman. I'm Batmole. No seducing my Pokemon. How dare you attack my Pokemon in this Pokemon battle? Die! Ah, oh, didn't even level up. Profound sadness. Go back to the sewers, Mikey. That's strange. I won before. Highly doubtful. Trainer tips. No stealing other people's Pokemon. Pokeballs are to be thrown only at wild Pokemon. I like the idea that Pokeballs act as like a registration of Pokemon. I'm not a trainer, but if only if you look in the eyes of one, prepare to battle. But you looked in my eyes, and I'm a Pokemon trainer. You're supposed to fight me. Instead of a bug Pokemon, I found a trainer. I think I've been insulted. This child has no legs. No legs. No legs, Mikey. Bubble that bug. Bungle. Oh, a critical hit. Yay. Leave my toad to die alone. You stupid bug child. You're a bug. Why aren't you doing bug things? A bug can't tackle a, a, a tadpole. A Toto pole. Almost. I shall swap him out so that my owl can get some experience too.
go owl. Murder this bug. I should have probably growled. At least now, we're even. Growl! Now your tackles won't do any damage. Like I said, won't do any damage. Now it really is like a bug just ramming into you. Oh no, the worm is tackling me. It's doing the worm at me. The horror. And that Caterpie died. And everyone was happy. Ah, you're too strong. You literally only have bugs. What did you think was going to happen? Magical fun times at the spa? What would a Pokemon spa look like? Imagine getting a muscle rub from a Machoke. Or even worse, a Machamp. Youngster Joey wants a rematch. This is Joey, got a minute? Let's get together and battle. I promise things will be different. Round 30 is where I'll be. Give me a shout when you come by later. Okay, that's quickly. Super quick, he already wants a rematch. I guess I'll get more experience out of him. And now his Rattata, or whatever, will be level 50 and ready to eat me. I don't even know anymore. All my topics of conversation were just obliterated when I started playing this game. Please don't be a polywag. I don't want no more polywags. Let's see if we can escape this one, because we have... We want to make progress. We have progress to make. So please. Please. <laughs> Marasmus! Can we have new weapons, please? Please? Bonus duck! I've been waiting. Let's battle now. Let's see what level your Pokemon are. Well, Pokemon is... It hasn't leveled at all. That's friggin' hilarious. Bubble it. Bubble it all the way home. Drown it in bubbles, my Toto Dial. Drown it in bubbles. Bubbles! Dang it. Now I got one hit off. My perfect, my perfect run is ruined. Bye bye, Radada. You leveled up, my boy. Toto dial. <laughs> Hypnosis. What? I lost again. Tag on it. Well, call whenever you're ready. Becoming a good trainer is really tough. I'm gonna battle other people to get better. Thank God they don't all want to add you to their phones. That would be kind of crazy. Every single trainer you fight, add them to your phone. <laughs> but seriously? <gasps> Wait! Hypnosis! When the wild dog, when the dog guardians come to play, maybe I can put them to sleep and catch them. Oh! Oh! It'll be glad. I'm gonna put a hot spot in first so that we can hopefully make some progress. I can't go that way anyway. Wait. This tree can be cut. I know that there is a pseudo wudo out there. For some reason, it's a rock type despite being wood. And that's just wrong. Why? Not the polywag. My hotspot's gonna die. Can we escape, please? Thank you. I, I'm done with polywags. They lower my speed. Dark cave. If Pokemon could light it up, I'd explore it. I found a potion! Yay. I'm gonna steal your berries. A bitter berry. 
it makes your Pokemon sad and want to murder you. Huh? <laughs> I walked too far today looking for Pokemon. My feet hurt and I'm sleepy. If I were a wild Pokemon, I'd be easy to catch. <sighs> this is my Pokeball. I caught a bunch of Pokemon. Let me battle with you. Time for Pokeball battles with little Wade. Really, kid? Level two, die. How dare you try to bondage my hotspot? He is a good boy. You did one damage, die. Level 10 hotspot, yay! We will not change Pokemon. First, smoke screen! Do not let it poison our comrades! And now that it can't see, we will leer at it lustfully to put it off its guard. If you poison my boy. And next, soften him up! Okay, maybe you're a little too strong for that. Well, we won't, uh... We won't do the fool thing, but we will leer. And now, we'll send out... Toto Dial! Or, uh, eh, well, Owl works too. Now, uh, one damage critical hit. <laughs> we don't even need to growl at it. Yeah. Wow. I think I may have overdone things. Why is the wild Pokemon more powerful than you? No need to growl. Merely need to murder. Your one damage attacks. Pitiful. Die. Ah! And I sent some money home to mom. I found a Pokeball, yeah. But where's the Pokemon that goes inside it? I found a good Pokemon in Dark Cave. I'm going to raise it to take on Faulkner. He's the leader of Violet City's gym. Actually, speaking of that, I want to see. We can't make progress in Dark Gym unless you are super precise with your movements and know where you're going. So, but we can still capture a Pokemon in here. This is neat music. It's an angry Geo dude. <gasps> this is the perfect leveling spot for my boy. Toto Dial. All rights reserved. Do not copy. Originals character. Do not steal. Now, Bubble. I just want to see what's in here, and maybe level up Toto Dial a little bit. <laughs> I still don't know why a Poliwag is here. I just don't really think Poliwag is early game Pokemon. Yeah, I've never heard the extra instrumentation in this game before. Ah, I left. Fight me again, or do you know that I have a Poliwag? Uh, now we gotta fight Zubat. Yeah, for the looks of things, it's just a normal cave. Do I want... Do I want a Geodude? I guess I could use a Geodude. And if I, like, run into a 
enemy that uses... I don't know. I'm trying to think of the ad advantages again. <laughs> Don't make me use my hypnosis on yes. Good, it died. It made the smart decision and died. I just want to fight another Geodude. But yeah, it just seems to be a normal cave of Zubats and Geodudes. Except this one might not even have Machamp, uh, Machops. Geodude, Geodude. The game knows. The game knows. But it's a level 4, so it would be kind of a waste to just walk away from this fight, so we're gonna kill you out of spite. How dare you! How dare you not be a Geodude! <laughs> you ever just walk around your home and somebody enters and just like, How dare you not be someone else and kills you? Because that's what happened to that poor Zubat. All I wanted was to steamroll some Geodudes. <laughs> and that evil Zubat stole away my chance of glory! Speaking of stealing away glory... I mean, I could maybe try hypnosis in you. Actually, that might not be half bad. hypnosis in you and then throwing out Owl. Hypnosis! Ah! Fear not. Hypnosis! I hate that it says it doesn't affect. Does it actually not affect it? Or is it just missing? Go! Sleep well, little Billy. Ha 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 ha. It's sleeping Pokemon dreams. Now go, Owl. Swoop away with the child. <laughs> you will die. You will die, small child. Sleep. Sleep and stay slippin'. <laughs> yes! Sleep away your life! And now it died sleeping. My old tactics are coming back with a vengeance. Hi there! Did you visit Sprout Tower? No. I came too far out. I'd better phone home. E.T. Phone home. It was around three years ago. Team Rocket was up to no good with Pokemon. But justice prevailed. A young kid broke him up. That was me. A guy named Bill made the Pokemon PC storage system. Pokemon are smart. They won't obey a trainer they don't respect. Without the right gym badges, they'll just do as they please. How do Pokemon know the concept of badges? How do they know badges? How do they know badgers? That's the real question. Why is my leg starting to hurt? I do not know why. My body is falling to ashes. Hello, child. Ghosts are rumored to appear in Sprout Tower. They said normal type Pokemon moves had no effect on ghosts. And in this game, you don't even need... What's it called? You don't even need... The Sylph Scope. Yes, three years ago, they started implanting Sylph Scopes in everybody's heads. I collect Pokemon. Do you have a Bell Sprout? Want to trade it for my Onyx? Onyx is actually a... One, I would never have that abomination monster bastard that is Bellsprout. Second, Onyx is such a poor Pokemon. A Pokemon you get in trade grows quickly. 
but if you don't have the right gym badge, they may disobey you. Earl's Pokemon Academy. I traded to my best Pokemon to the guy beside me. Huh? The Pokemon I got is holding something. It's a bomb! A Pokemon holding a berry will heal itself in battle. Many other items can be held by Pokemon. It sure is tough name to make taking notes. I'm taking notes of the teacher's lecture. I better copy the stuff on the blackboard too. It's this kid's notebook. Catch Pokemon using Pokeballs. Up to six can be in your party. Keep reading? Sure. Before throwing the Pokeball, weaken the target first. A poisoned or burned Pokemon is easier to catch. Keep reading. Some moves may cause confusion. Confusion may take a Pokemon, uh, make a Pokemon attack itself. Leaving battle clears up any confusion. Keep reading. People who catch and use Pokemon in battle are Pokemon trainers. They are expected to use Pokemon gyms and defeat other trainers. The next page is blank. <laughs> I haven't written anymore. The blackboard describes Pokemon status effects. Oh yeah, that, for some reason that reminds me. Another game uh, in the Pokemon series, well, Pokemon games in the Pokemon series that I'm going to have to get to, are the Ranger games. I've never played them before. City of Nostalgic Sense. Faulkner from the Violet City Gym is a fine trainer. He inherited his father's gym and has done a great job with it. But what if I murder him and take over? The elegant master of flying Pokemon. What? Hello, are you a trainer? Battle gym leader in you did. No. Is that so? Then study shall you. Follow me. Ah, I've been kidnapped by a spinning man. Here, teacher. I am good at his. You study here. I've been kidnapped by a fat spinning de ballerina man. Earl, I am wonderful on Pokemon, yes. Teach you I will be to be better trainer. What you want, though? Want to be winner is you? A winner is you. Good, teach you I will. And battle Pokemon top on list, jump on first. Change order in list to make battle easy, maybe. More from me, you want to hear? Sure. So want to know how to race Pokemon well? Fine, teach you I will. If Pokemon come out in battle, even briefly some XP points it gets. At top of list, we put weak Pokemon. Switch in battle quick. This way, weak Pokemon strong become. He does convey the uh, actual points, so despite his broken English, he is actually teaching you good points. I didn't realize Ballerino Man would kidnap me, though. I saw a weekly tree up ahead. If you touch it, it squirms and dances. Cool. That wiggly tree will try to murder you. She uses the names of her favorite things to eat for the nickname she gives her to her Pokemon, I mean. Strawberry. That's an adorable name. I call my Pitchy Strawberry. Well, first things first, I think I'm gonna buy up some potions. How may I help you? Give me all your money! <laughs> Give me all your money! Do -do 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 -do. Well, we might as well see what level the people in the gym are. See if we can beat them up. Yes, I would like to overwrite. What's, what's the point of saving, if not to overwrite the previous save data? Hey, I'm no trainer, but I can give some advice. Believe me, if you believe in championship dream can come true. You believe, then listen. The grass type is weak against flying type. Keep this in mind. Let me see if you are good enough to face Falconer. I'm a more serious, less funky looking bird keeper. Hey, it actually moved. I like it. It's all oh god, it's level nine! Hypnosis! Ah! Hypnosis! Ah! Hypnosis! You have failed me. 
That's what you get for failing me, you stupid little Toto Dial. You're supposed to make them squirm. Smoke screen. Leer. I don't think it's working. Its accuracy is lowered, yet it's still landing hits. No, the berry! My berry boy! Oh hey, it finally missed. That's a lot of experience. This can't be true! And now I'm gonna go heal up my dude. Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Bloop, bleep, bloop, bloop. Hey, you're a Pokemon trainer. If you beat the gym leader here, you'll be ready for, uh, for prime time. Oh, fight next. Demon Man, the key word is guts. Those here are training night and day to become bird Pokemon masters. Come on. Let's -a go. <laughs> Rod. He sent out a Pidgey. Go, Toto Dial. Oh, one more hypnosis. Hey, you actually worked. Good job, Pidgey. I said good luck, Pidgey, instead of Totodile, because my brain's on fire. Now, smother it in its sleep. Smother the Pidgey! Make it die! Oh boy! Critical hit, too. Kill him! Kill the bird! Kill the bird! Kill the bird! Make it rule the day it ever woke up! Bird must die! And it killed him with a critical hit. Sick murder, Totodile. I will keep this, my Pokemon out to see if we can hypnosis it once more. Profound sadness. <laughs> we will swap out to Owl. Because he really needs some experience too. Well, she, I think. No, he. Luckily, I don't think these are going to use Sand Attack for some reason. Now it's going to use Sand Attack, and my experiment will be true. Now you, use Tackle Attack. Get a crit. I said get a crit, Owl. You're supposed to obey my action moves. question is, do I want to use... Of course you got a critical hit. Well, that solves my problem. I'll kill you of Totodile. Unless it gets another crit. But that's very rude of you, Pidgey. You're not supposed to get critical hits against trainers. It's too rude.
That's right. Gah! I'll shove you into the abyss of the dollar sign. This isn't a gym. It's a dollar store. Heal them up my, more of my Pokemon. They keep underperforming and getting eaten by crits. I don't even think... No, we do have a stab attack. Bubble. I keep forgetting because it's the only move that <laughs> Totodile knows naturally. Nope, wrong one. We want Switch. On Nintendo Switch. <laughs> That's gonna be where my Pokemon Arceus playthrough is. Da -da -dee -dee -do 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 -do. Hello, Falconer. I'm Falconer, the Violet Chitty, uh, Violet Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wings with a jolt of electricity. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of the magnificent bird Pokemon. Whatever you say, bird boy, with your baggy pants. And you're using a Pidgey. Already you have failed. Growl. If. Now, so long as you don't get any crits, I should win handily. Because your Pidgey doesn't know Growl. Kill the Pidgey Owl. Kill the Pidgey with prejudice. How dare you get a crit? That's favoritism on the part of the gym leader. Kill. Kill. Keep up the, the tackling, my boy. Another critical hit, but for me! What fun! What murderous fun! Yay! The boy has won the day! Yeah, he's gonna send out a Pidgeotto, eh? Hot spot! Go! Look at the pretty colors on the birdie. I'll have you know, I'm gonna obliterate you. Smoke screen! Because this isn't the anime, he can't blow the smoke screen away. See if he, this was the anime and he used Gust? That totally would have been super duper good. Good, for a moment there I thought it was gonna be super effective and I would have been sad. Why did you get a critical hit? Two critical... Well, I guess I got a critical hit after you got a critical hit. So this just means another critical hit is on its way. Why is your accuracy really good? That's just mean. Please don't get a crit on your side, Pidgeotto! Haha, <laughs> I got a critical hit instead. My math checked out! He learned it! Darn! My dad's chair is bird Pokemon! Alright, take this. It's the official Pokemon League Zephyr badge. Your prized dad's Pokemon are level 7 and level 9. Raises the attack power of Pokemon. It also enables Pokemon to use Flash, if they have it, anytime. Here, take this too. Watch this one. By using TM, a Pokemon will instantly learn a new move. Think before you act. A TM can be used only once. Mud Slap. It reduces the enemy's accuracy while it causes damage. In other words, it is a, both a defensive and offensive. 
I can't believe he forced me to use so many potions, cause he... Oh, Professor Elm. Hello, Neon. We discovered something about the egg. My assistant is at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you talk to him? He didn't even wait for me to answer. What an asshole. Normally you wait for people to answer your phone call. Neon, long time no see. Professor Elm asked me to find you. He has another favor to ask. Would you take care of the egg? Sure. I've got an egg! We discovered that a Pokemon will uh, ha not hatch until it grows in the egg. It also has to be with other active Pokemon to hatch. Neon, you're the only person we can rely on. Please call Professor Elm when that egg hatches. He's the leading authority on eggs and are of Pokemon, yet he can't afford a team of aides to help him with Pokemon stuff. That's kind of silly. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. No, 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 no. Does that mean that I can go to the Pokemon Tower now and murder some Bell Sprouts? Sprout Tower. Experience the way of the Pokemon. Actually, I'm going to experience the way of murdering a bunch of bastards to death, and it's gonna be fucking magical. I forgot that owl was already in first place, and I switched mid combat. A Bell Sprout over 100 feet tall. People say that it became the center pillar here. I want to burn this place down now! See that pillar shaking? People are training upstairs. I want to burn it down! Sprout Tower was built long ago as a place for Pokemon. I want to burn it down! Only if you reach the top will you obtain an HM. I want to burn it down! However hard we battle, the tower will stand strong. I'm gonna burn it down because it's based off of a bell sprout! My worst enemy, stupid monk boy. Monk man! Wow. Your Pokemon suck. Kill him. Kill! Kill the monster! The abomination! The vile bitch. The rap monster. The evil abomination of hell. You will die one by one. Your ancestors, three years ago, disturbed me, and now you must die for the sins of your ancestors. You know, people totally would have discovered Pokemon eggs within the three years of the games. It's like, oh, we just suddenly found a Pokemon egg. Bullshit. This is all staged. Silver is an actor. I don't even really need to growl at you, do I? You're so low level. They just don't want to teach kids the birds and the Pokebees. Or is it the Pidgeys? And what are they? The, the honeycomb Pokemon? Sage Nico. I fought hard, but I'm too weak. You're damn right, you're too weak, you stupid bastard. You, 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 you Bellsprout apologist. Who's gonna die here? Oh, hey, a Ghastly. Shit, I'm gonna have to use Ember. But I can catch a ghost Pokemon. Hotspot, go! So long as it doesn't instantly murder him, this should be fine. I'll have to put... Well, that works. And this allows me to put my plan to action. I can put Totodile in first place, 
switch to hotspot when I want to murder some bell sprouts. And switch to hot, uh, and just, uh, hopefully bubble them, uh, bubble ghastlies when I want to, when I want to capture a ghast, a ghastly. Sorry, I ate dinner, and for some reason, that makes me hiccup. We stand guard in this tower. Here we express our gratitude to honor all Pokemon. And I'm gonna burn this place down because it's based off of a bell sprout. Ugly man McMahon, bitch, who sent out a bell sprout. Hotspot, murder. You did one damage with a critical hit. Now let's see what I do with Ember. Ah, it's so delightful to hear the screams of bell sprouts. <laughs> I can hear your bell sprouts. As they die, they scream. Their screams bring me such joy. Kill, kill, kill them all! Bell sprouts will suffer, all of them, down to the last. No mercy. No mercy for the bell sprouts. They know what they did, and they will suffer eternally. Keep on using all your beloved bell sprouts. I will continue to destroy them. Because it is only fair. It is only just. It is the way. Die, bell sprout, die! I could probably annihilate them with just a tackle, come to think of it. Sage Chow. Thank you. Thank you for ridding me of these weeds. These monstrous weeds. <laughs> annihilate them all. Destroy them all. You will be next! Sway like leaves in the wind. Sway like a corpse about to fall. Kill it. Murder it. Slaughter the bell sprouts that dare. Get in my way. Kill. Murder. Slaughter them all. <laughs> Do not let the bell sprout live. Kill it. Crush it. We will leave Owl out to continue the slaughter and his leveling regimen. There will be better times to level up Totodile. For now, the slaughter of these weeds must commence. Die! Die! You monsters must die! No, I don't want to change. I want to merely watch them suffer. All these bell sprouts dare to exist within my sight. Kill it! Rid this world of their foul stench. Oh, I'm weak! Oh, yes, you are. A vile bit does not look distinguished. It looks vile. You will be next. I trained to find enlightenment in Pokemon. 
I train so that abominations like your glorious god suffer and die. You are <laughs> a valuable foe at long last. I will annihilate this monstrous existence. Oh well, that's not good. Kill it quick. Even with that, you still only accomplish a few points of damage. You're in denial, little weed. Now sleep amongst the earth. Rot and decay! My training is incomplete, just like your hairline. The Elder's HM lights even pitch black darkness. I'm gonna have to find an HM slave, won't I? Another fool. I would try and kill you of Totodile to level him up. But sadly, it would be ineffective. So Owl will have to take over that duty. You are weak! Rotten decay become the nutrients that feed the earth, you stupid little weed. Die. Die! Suffer immensely at my anger and hatred. Almost a level! It is my head that is bright! Well, you yourself aren't very bright. We shall heal the boy. We have potions to spare. And now... Kill this man! Let me see how much you trust your Pokémon. I will watch them tear you limb from limb. A level seven, huh? How cute. Considering it raises its special attack, I assume that Vine Whip is a special attack. But not special enough! You barely cling to life. Yay! Level up! A hoot hoot, huh? Totodile, go! I will humor you with this bubble explosion. Silly fool is a special attack. Hypnosis! Aww. <laughs> Silly fool. Hypnosis! Come on, Totodile. We're working on this for very important reasons. Hypnosis! <laughs> Hypnosis! Good boy. Now drown the hoot hoot in its sleep. Slowly but surely. The bubbles enter, clog its veins. Air permeating in a water shell. Its screams will be muffled. Its gasps rattled as it dies in its sleep. 
<laughs> yes, your trust is real. I trusted my Pokemon to put your Pokemon to sleep and murder it to death. Now that the leveling is out of the way, let us try and level up Hot Spot some. What? You are indeed as skilled as a trainer. As promised, here is your HM. But let me tell you this, you should treat your Pokemon better. The way you battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools of war. Hello, bastard. Ha! Huh. He claims to be the Elder, but he's weak. It stands to reason. I'd never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon. I only care about strong Pokemon that can win. I really couldn't care less about weak Pokemon. Carl used escape rope! Bastard. I wanted to fight him. It is not looking distinguished, it looks monstrous. Hello, old man. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between your Pokemon and you. Your Pokemon will falter and die like all of the rest of them. You're not even worth a leer. Ember! Sage Lee. Ah, uh, we won't be able to cheese this one. Smoke screen. <laughs> I should have known. I forgot about that. Leer! And now, since we lowered its defense, tackle attack! Keep tackling. Pummel it into the earth. Booyah, level up for hot spot. Another bell sprout, perfect fodder for my beloved hot spot. Burn it to the ground. Booyah. Ah, excellent. You and your Pokemon should have no problem using this move. Take this flashy gym. Yay! Flash illuminates even the darkest of places, but to use it out of battle, you need the badge from Violet's gym. I already did. <gasps> it is time to fight a ghastly. But I can't use uh, em, uh, I can't use Ember on that, so I'm gonna have to send out Totodile. Totodile, wait, you're probably gonna kill it too. Fuck. Okay. Now that's just rude. I'm gonna throw a Pokeball. It's only level five. Go Pokeball. Worst comes worst, maybe I can try and hypnosis it. Yes. Yes. Huh. Cool. I didn't even need to fight it. It wraps its opponent in its gas-like body, slowly weakening its prey by poisoning it through skin. Why are you a monster? What name shall we give you? The extra instrumentation's kind of throwing me off, but we'll call you Sherry. But 
how do I get to those other places in this place? The middle. There were trainers. A ratata, huh? No time for you. Kill it! Bye bye! I guess I'll put Sherry. Oh. Sherry wants to die again. Let's get together and battle. I promise things will be different. Totally. I'm gonna put Sherry into first place. First move between the eggs. Is that all my active Pokemon are up there? And see if we can level up Sherry some. Is it another Radita? It's another Ghastly. So it's just gonna be another diddly D. It only knows hypnosis and leak. Bye bye. I leave. I probably could have thrown out a normal Pokemon to fight it, but how do I get to the center? Do I fall down? I can't fall down. It's a mystery to everyone. I shall send out Totodile. Wash away this ghost. Damn it. Hotspot. Burn away this ghost. Are you kidding me? Twice in a row? That's bullshit. Like, that actually is bullshit. That's a low accuracy move, isn't it? How did it hit twice? Well, I sometimes can't get it to land four times in a row. Kill! Murder all the do. Oh, that, yeah, that really killed the experience gang. Oh, so I guess we already went, uh, makes sense, I guess, maybe, I don't know. Stairs in that place is crazy. So I guess, yeah, Bell Sprout Tower, Sprout Tower, and the other place, the Burn Tower, is later. Why does this place have so many towers? And they healed the uh, the egg. We put the egg in a Pokeball, I guess. Doo doo. Blackthorn City. I wonder if what would happen if we went that way to Route 46. You're able to go there, but it doesn't feel like you're supposed to. You critique? Mount Morta. I don't know where to go. I'm sure... Well, I guess we it wants me to go through the dark cave. Let's see. Who can learn HMs? Sure. Looks like you're learning Flash. A little annoying, but hey. But hey, but hey. Now, my boy, use Flash! Oh. Uh, I'll keep Sherry in first place. Let him level up a bit. Doo -doo -doo. Love the music. Oh! Huh, okay, so this place is, uh, uh, 
You can get flash, but you can't go anywhere. That's kind of funny. Time for your first real battle. Lick this hoot hoot. <gasps> it's the perfect bat matchup. It can't get, it can't hit you. What do you mean it doesn't affect the hoot hoot? God damn it. Kale! I guess it... What typing are you? We're gonna have to look at Owl to see why the hell the Hoot Hoot refuses to die. It's an angry Hoot Hoot that doesn't want to die. Too bad, you're gonna die! I said you're going to die. Hoot Hoot. Bye bye, Hoot Hoot. You're fucking dead. Yeah, what typing are you? Owl. Normal flying. I get. Oh, Lick must be one of those stupid moves that's just like, it doesn't affect this Pokemon. When all it actually means is it missed. Stupid tech boxes! Text boxes make no sense and deserve to die in fire and flame. We carry on. Guitar solo. Dee 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 dee. Barry. <laughs> Paralysis cure. The purse cure. Barry. Ruins of Alf. East entrance. You're studying the ruins. I see a scientist in the making. Ruins of Alf. A look and touch tourist site. Try the sliding stone panels. There are drawings on stone panels. I tried moving them. I wonder what they are. Ruins of Alf. Visitors, welcome. Ruins of Alf. Research Center. The authority on the uh, Ruins of Alf. The ruins are about 1,500 years old, but it's not known why they were built or by whom. There are odd patterns drawn on the walls of the ruins. They must be the keys for unraveling the mystery of the ruins. This doesn't seem to work yet. I might have to look up, because I think I remember the uh, unknown puzzles being weird. Mystery stone panel chamber, so... Welcome to this chamber. There are sliding panels that depict a Pokemon drawn by the ancients. Slide the panels around to form the picture. To the right is the description of the Pokemon. Scientists in the back are examining some newly found patterns. Recently, strange cryptic patterns have appeared. It's odd. They weren't here a little while ago. You should take a look at the walls. Patterns appeared on the walls. Escape? Does it want me to use an escape rope? A Pokemon that hid on the sea floor. Eyes on its back scan the area. Oh, Kabuto! I can already tell. And nobody discovered this before. Nobody... This really makes me feel... Nope, yeah, they're swap. Right? Uh, maybe? Yeah. Oh, I've got it wrong. I had to, I had to move more again. Bleh. Okay. 
Gotta move these. Gotta move. Gotta move them all. Gotta move them all. Nope, wrong one. No? Oh, uh, maybe these swap? There we go. Messed that up. Falling into the dark! There's a strange presence here. It's a replica of ancient Pokemon. Replica of ancient Pokemon. It said escape on the wall. I still wonder if it, that means it wants me to use... Or does it want me to capture the word escape? I think it might want me to capture the word escape. While exploring the ruins, we suddenly noticed an odd presence. We all got scared and ran away. You should be careful too. The ruins hide a huge secret, I think. So yeah, it probably wants me to capture and have in my inventory the word escape in this room. That tremor was pretty scary, but I'm more concerned about this wall here. Recently, Stray yeah, Crypt have appeared. It's, yeah, they weren't here a little while ago. You should take a look at them. I'm going to count just to make sure I'm not being dumb. One, two, three, four, five, six. They want me to capture the word E-S-C-A-P-E. I guess I could try. It would be nice if there was a Pokemon Center here. That's basically my takeaway. Would... Alright. I shall save. Wait. It's a freaking save. It's already a save file. No duh. That's the point of save files. Now save over it. It's a one save file RPG. Don't ask me that. I need the word escape. I think you're the word you're the letter C. I need you. In my belly. Come to me unknown. You're much more powerful in the movie. Yes. Yes, yes. Damn you. Lick it. Go Pokeball, I need this C. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm going to just call you C. Because different types of unknown exist, it is said that they must have a variety of abilities. Nope. You are C. I'm going to leave, heal up, stock up on Pokeballs, come back, and continue capturing unknown until I have the word escape. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm allergic to obtuse puzzles. Imagine living just a jaunt away from ancient ruins. I guess that must be what it's like to live in 
like, Europe. Where they're basically begging people to move in and maintain castles. Got him, got a, I forgot to buy more Pokeballs. Damn it. Here unknown, here unknown. I need to capture E S A P E. I need to capture E S A P E. I already have you, and I think you're the leather C. You, I guess I probably should have tried to kill you and level up Sherry. I don't need an eye. Sherry, it's a bastard. Lick it. I use hidden power. Oh! Lick it again. How come you did more damage? You're a bastard. Don't kill Sherry. Why did you get to kill Sherry? Fuck you. No. That's just annoying. How come he did more damage? What even is hidden power? D. I don't need a D. I just want to leave. I need to go back again, heal my Pokemon, and actually buy more Pokeballs this time. I really should just go and level up Sherry. Why are they both super powerful to each other? It makes no sense. Oh no, water is weak to fire and fire is weak to water. That's basically what they're saying to me. How dare they undermine the sanctity of the Weapon Triangle, here, in Fire Emblem Crystal. Heal my gas- he heal my dead Pokémon. Heal my dead Pokémon, right now. You will heal my dead Pokémon, or you will become a dead Pokémon. Now I gotta make it all the way back to the ruins of Alf. Ruins of Alf. And when I see a unknown I don't need, send out Hotspot to murder. I need another Pokemon. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. I'm doing a dance. I'm doing a dance. Come fight me. I'm doing a dance. Another D, huh? I don't need no D. I need you. Dead. I swear if it's super effective, I'm going to punch you. Good. I'm still gonna punch you, but now I'm gonna do it lovingly. Basically means... Ah, I see. You're a bitch. It's the one that I need, that I require. I was, I meant to hit hypnosis. Why is hypnosis first in the list? What, 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 what do you mean? It doesn't affect- I don't care! Go, Pokeball! I need that E. Good. Hypnosis. Do you just have 100% accuracy? When it- Go, Pokeball! Capture the sleeping unknown! Wait. 
I think I need two E's for escape. I swear if it breaks out while it's asleep, then I'm gonna murder it. Yay! U R E. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. I don't need an H. I require your damnation. Jesus Christ, Sherry, you are scary. Sherry is scary. Now lick it to death. That would be a very odd and horrific fate, being licked to death. I'm not sure how it would work, but it sounds terrible. Oh yeah, Sherry leveled up. Jesus Christ, almost leveled up twice. I'm walking around. I'm a lost child. I hope that no mysterious Pokemons come to abduct me and give me a new family. Uh, what even are you? What even are you supposed to be? Well, let's get out of here and check the diddly-doo again. I just want to make sure. Yes, yes. No, no, no. Come on, bring it back up. E. S. Yeah. That's not one that I require. Now let's just jump back down. Oh no, I am a poor child. I hope reality warping Pokemon don't give me a giant beef... Giant beefy dog Pokemon as a dad. It's a D. Hypnosis. You finally missed. Not hidden power. Lick it to death. Lick it. Lick it. Kill it. Yay. Now it's paralyzed. Darn it. It's not paralyzed. Finish it off! Lick. If it survived, I was gonna be angry. And of course, use a potion on Sherry. I don't need a D. I don't want to overlevel Sherry to the point that we can't capture the unknown that we require. Come on, E. I don't need what I assume to be a G. Or the number eight. Either way, I don't need you. At least I don't think so. Escape. Nope. Come on, come on. I do think that I require another E. Come with me, Lick. You bastard. Come with me if you want to live. Come on. It's a nice life living in a Pokeball. Y 
U R E. Uh, fine. You can't put numbers for some reason. He is E2. Like Mewtwo, but worse. <laughs> the pack. I'm still not used to it not being items. Alright, so we have C and two E's. Now we need E, uh, S, A, and P. I don't need a D! And considering that I'm playing as a girl, that is very inappropriate. Shame on you. Keeps throwing D's at me. These nuts. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Do a little dance. I do not require an eye. I do not require an eye. I still don't know what you are. A Y? A Z? An apostrophe? Here are non. Here are non. S A P. I do not require you. You look like a duck. So you better waddle away, waddle, waddle. I'm dancing. I'm dancing for unknown. Uh, a K? I don't need a K. I'm dancing. Here, I need an A. Come to me. You know that the game got, like, super upgraded when they just like, we're gonna have 26 Pokemon that are the same Pokemon. Lol. Please don't run. I'll get very upset. Yes. Now you'll be super easy to catch. Don't fucking run. Thank you. I don't know why that one ran. And now I'm just going to be paranoid of it happening every single time. Pokeball. Now I just need an S and a P. Need an S and a P, an S and a P, an S and a P. I think. I already have all the E's that I require for this puzzle. I just hope that I'm not like horribly doing things out of order. Like you're not supposed to do this until later. I do not require an H. Dancing, I'm dancing, I'm dancing. Dancing for an S and a P. I've already gotten my A. Be gone. I'm dancing. I do not require a J. I dance. I dance. For an S and a P. I do not require G's either. I do not require G's. I must fight. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. 
I don't require H's. Ah! I'm dancing. I do not require. <gasps> okay. You horrid little bastard. Fight me. Fight me. S and P. No, no, no. I require. I wonder who the ancient Pokemon is that's on the statues. Uh, I do not need an eye at this time. Maybe I should have caught the J and stuff, but I don't know, I just wanna. I don't wanna. Sp I'm, uh, I just want. I want the P. It's on the wall, right there. I need it. Gib. Gib. I do not require you. So this is where the English language came from. I find it hilarious that... <laughs> ah! I don't need... a... P... a G. It's a G there. I think it's a G. But I don't need a G. I need... S and P. I already have an A. I already have it. Shut up. Leave me alone. Ah. And I don't want to over level Sherry. Just imagine if I've been killing all the unknown I've been running into. Firstly, that would have taken a lot of trips to the uh, Nurse Joy. But it also would have over leveled Sherry to the point that I wouldn't be able to capture these dudes. Oh, hey, we found another C. We don't need you. I need escape. Escape. S. P. S and P. S and P. <laughs> I do not require G minor. I require S and P. I'm gonna refresh myself while they look. Huh? That's Pokedex, isn't it? May I see it? There are so many kinds of Pokemon, hmm? What's this? What is this Pokemon? It looks like strange writing on the walls of the ruins. If those drawings are really Pokemon, there should be many more. I know, let me upgrade your Pokedex. Follow me. I've been kidnapped again! Is it gonna track the alphabet? Done! I modified your Pokedex. I added an optional Pokedex to store unknown data. It records them in the sequence that they were caught. The unknown will ca uh, catch will all be recorded. Check to see how many kinds exist. So now it's a mini Pokedex. Alright, so if we run into any more like K's and J's I'll, and I's, I'll catch them, I guess, just to make sure that they're not, like, super rare. The J is probably a super rare unknown. Though not as rare in S... Not as rare as S and P, apparently. They better not be daylight unknown. Oh, sorry. That part of the alphabet only comes out during the day. <laughs> that would be a weird mechanic for Sesame Street. Sorry, everybody. We can't bring you the, uh, the letter that's brought this episode because it only comes out at night. Every single time an unknown that I've already caught comes by, I scream. <laughs> unknown mode. I require, I require S. And P. S. And P unknown. S. And P unknown. Mm. 
S and P unknown. S and P unknown. S and P unknown. S and P. S and P unknown. S and P. S and P. S and P. I just want to catch the right unknown. I guess I'll catch you. Name your D, add it to my Pokedex. My name is D. Die. Die. I swear if you break out, I'm gonna kill you. Ed knew I was good for it. Stupid little bitch. It kind of looks like an unfinished Pokeball, but it's actually an H. Okay, critical hit. Nice. And paralyzed. Ha 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 ha. You're disgusting. And once again, if you break out, I will kill you on principle. Yes, yes, yes. Finally. You are H. For hell. S and P. S and P. S and P. I assume you're G. We'll go ahead and catch you, just so that we can have you. Even though this is gonna eat up all my Pokeballs, and you're probably going to kill Sherry right now. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send that hot spot. I'm very sad and angry. And now, and, now, and, and now I'm gonna throw a Pokeball and it's probably gonna escape because it's a jerk. Yes. 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 Huh. It actually went through. And this should be a G. A lowercase G. I think. Because there's nothing that looks like it because it's... Two balls on top of each other with a line on the bottom going left and a line on the top going right. I don't know what that would be. I'm gonna say G. If I'm wrong, yeah, fuck me. No, 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 no. Ah. My brain's on fire. I just want to do this puzzle. I want. I just want an S and a P. An S and a P. I can't continue until I escape by spelling escape in unknown. Well, we have Mr. J. I guess. Might as well capture you. Maybe I should speed up this section. It's on it. It's an emulator. I can do that. And really, there's no reason not to. We're just... Screw it. No, no. Just like, speed up this section. It's not giving me the diddly Ds that I require for the puzzle. Wow, would you look at that? We ran into another J already. It's a friggin' J walker. I should probably heal my, my Sherry again. I can't just say my boy anymore because they actually have genders in this game. S and P, S and P. Also, this is really gonna throw off the clock, I think. But 
but I'd rather do this. I think that's a... It's either a P or an F, but... I might as well capture it. Because it, it's either an F or a P. The way that the top is done makes me think P, but the fact that it has a little middle part makes me think F. Well, we'll capture it anyway, and then I'll just name it F or P. Yes, yes, yes. Skip ahead. <gasps> I... Damn it. I'm just... My brain's just like, I want an F or a P. Or an S or a P. I already have you. It's the first time that I'll be doing this puzzle in full, I think, because I never bothered to actually capture all the unknown necessary. I don't need an eye, but I guess I could capture you. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> That's just rude. <laughs> How dare I speed up the emulator when the game isn't giving me the Pokemans I need. And I don't think I've already caught an eye. Go, Pokeball. I'm gonna have to go get more Pokeballs and heal up and potions and... Uh... Get in my belly. I. I am done being a good Samaritan person. Be like, oh, I won't use speed up. It's it's getting tedious. It is it I haven't even seen an S. Yes, well, yo. Thank you. Just for this section with the unknown will I speed up. Because it uh, it's so tedious. Once again, I swear, if my joke about them being daytime letters is real, I'm gonna go ahead, take a look, and see what it, the P looks like in here. Ah, dang it. Nope, the P looks like that, so that indeed is an F. The unnicknamed unknown is F. I already have an E. E. Hello, F. Why do you have the nose? I don't even know what you're supposed to be. There's like, oh, screw it, I'm, I don't care anymore. Why are we getting F so often? I swear, if it's actually tied to something where unknown, only certain unknowns spawn in certain places. All right, you don't come up too often. I'm going to assume that you are a K. Mainly because the line... I'd be annoyed if it's an X. Why do you do so much fucking damage? I'm gonna have to go back and heal again. Hypnosis. It's in your bag. Hypnosis. And this one is a K. Yes, I would like to give it K. And I guess I'll use a potion instead. Let me see how many potions do I have. Four? Nope, I'm heading back to the Pokemon Center. Screw. I don't need, I don't want you. Go away. I don't like doing this, but dear God. The unknown are not cooperating. Hey, at least this is working towards the egg. That's something. And also, it's their fault for putting 
the unknown here this early. I still don't know what you are. Question mark, exclamation point. Question mark, exclamation point. We already have a K. I require S or P. Okay. I'm going to look this up because this is getting ridiculous. Pokemon Crystal Unknown Hunting. What are the rules to the unknown? I swear if they only come out... It's not even that. I'm. You're actually supposed to use an escape rope in there, which I guess makes sense, but at the same time, they're an alphabet. <laughs> Dang it. You'd think that that... Like, come on. It's a six-letter word. You'd think that that would be the thing. So you are supposed to use... Let me read the, gu the thing again, just to be sure. Use an escape rope. That's what it says. I would assume since it's a six... Like, personally, I would have had it be, like... Have it be a certain, like, thing. I don't know. Nah. But I just thought that it would be a thing. But let's use the escape rope, then. And it says that a hole will appear. Okay. That'll ease up things easily. Ah, here's another huge hole. It's big enough to go through. Well, joke's on me, I guess. For thinking, hey, the six-letter word wants you to uh, capture the... Uh, especially because after you do the first puzzle, that's what it should have been. They should not have started the unknown appearing yet. Because then it kind of made... That would have trained people to be like, oh, you don't use the unknown for the puzzles. Words. Words shall. Wait. Our words shall. What's that one? P E M A I N? Or is that R? Our words shall remain here for. The ages? Then what is that other one? Our word shall remain here for the ages, is what I think it says. And I'm getting out of here. Huh? Oh, the egg. It's hatching super early, probably, because I thought... I misunderstood the unknown. It's a togepi. I'll keep it togepi. Yeah, I swear, like, for whatever reason, it's just like, doesn't that make sense? Doesn't it make sense that... The ruins hide a huge secret, I think. They have, you'd think that that would be the thing, right? You'd think that the six-letter word that mo like especially because most of the unknown letters that spell escape have been appearing. It just feels right, don't you think? But yeah, the way that I would personally fix that to because I'm dumb and misunderstood the entire thing is I would have made it so that the unknown start appearing after 
you do the first puzzle. Because then you don't get thinking, oh, that thing. But let's call Professor Elm. But again, just to just plain say it, I'm dumb, but they spell it in unknown letters. A, the, a, a good amount of the unknown that were spawning spelled escape, and all I needed was two letters to spell escape. Especially because, well, the 15... <laughs> would a 1500... A 1500-year-old civilization even have escape ropes? I will call Professor Elm. Hello, Dion. How is the egg? What? It hatched? Wow! What kind of Pokemon is it? Please, come show me now! Sure, it will ease my agony. I'm still annoyed. Because it just it feels right to have tried to... It's a six-letter word. You have six Pokemon slots. A decent amount of the Pokemon of the unknown that were spawning spelled escape. Only two are missing. Which, I guess, fair. Two of them are repeats, but it's just like... It just feels right. Hello. I've been waiting. Let's battle now. You can train my Sherry. Do you have more Pokemon this time? Has your Rattata leveled up at all? It is the same level. Shameful. You can't even attack my Sherry. What do you mean it doesn't affect the enemy Rattata? What do you mean it doesn't affect the enemy Rattata? It's a normal type! Doesn't affect Radata. That is the dumbest thing in the world. Honestly. How does ghost type not affect the most normal of all normal types? One more for the road. That is the dumbest thing ever. That is so freaking dumb. Did they reverse the typing? Do ghosts not attack normal types, but normals are critical against ghosts or something? What the hell? That is just like the dumbest thing in the world. I hate it. It's a freaking normal type. It's a Ratato. Why doesn't... It will kill! Yeah, that's just the dumbest thing ever. I hate it. Also, Togepi doesn't have any attack moves. Maybe I should give it Mud Slap. I don't know. I don't even know if it can learn Mud Slap. That is legitimately far dumber. It's like, I can understand the ruins of Alf. Like... <laughs> stinking thing. I can understand that. Because it's a puzzle. Even though I think it's kind of dumb that the six-letter word with most unknown that you can capture right out of the gate. It's just like... And the funny thing is, I said immediately, oh, I have to use an escape rope. But then that was immediately overrode because I figured you were going to do something interesting with the unknown. I thought that's what they were going to do. Hey, here's this new letter-based Pokemon with a six-letter word. Maybe that's supposed to make me want to capture and level up. <laughs> or, or capture of the unknown so that it can spell words. No. It's bullshit. <laughs> I hate it. I'm angry. I'm gonna have to see if... Togepi can learn Mud Slap after this, purely because I wanted to have an attack move. Here's Togepi. What? That Pokemon! The egg hatched! So Pokemon are born from eggs? No, perhaps not all Pokemon are. Wow, there's still a lot of research to be done. Thanks, Neon. You're helping unravel Pokemon mysteries for us. I want you to have this as a token of our appreciation. That's an Everstone. 
some species of Pokemon evolve when they grow to certain levels. A Pokemon holding the Everstone won't evolve. Give it to a Pokemon you don't want to evolve. I shall give it to my beloved, my beloved boy, Hotspot. I shall give to Hotspot so I don't have to mash B every time that I want him to not love, uh, evolve so he can learn proper fire moves. And then once he gets proper fire moves, bibbidi bop. Oh yeah, and I'll see if my beloved little dude can learn mud slap. Have mud slap, Togepi, so that you can actually, like, attack and level up and stuff. That's probably a horrible misuse, but. I'm tilted. I am still tilted after the ruins of Alf and learning that ghost types can't attack normal. Or maybe there's a super secret god typing for this little bitch. I almost, almost want to capture it just so that I can be like, what is your typing? This is gonna fucking take forever. Mud slap is a terrible move. Fine, we'll, we'll end it. Kill it. <laughs> I why? Why is mud slap such a terrible move? Apparently. I just wanted Togepi to be able to attack and level up on its own. <laughs> Fuck off, Joey, I don't care! I know that there was a lot more and he was like, had a story to tell. But I'm tilted. I don't care about you, Joey. Every other time you called me, it's just, hey, I'm doing a baby, baby, baby. Fall off a cliff, Joey. Can I sleep in my bed? This is my home. Why can I not sleep in my bed? Do I have to talk to mother? Hey mother, can I sleep in my own bed? But she's the bank. Hi, welcome home. You kept your room tidy, or is this about money? No. Do you want to switch to daylight savings time? No. Just do what you can. I can't even sleep at my own goddamn house. But yeah, the ru uh, I'm still going to talk about it, because it's an annoying thing. Why can't the ghost type hit Ratata? Why can't the ghost type- I'm just going to run. <laughs> you can't escape! <laughs> I'm super tilted. I would be less tilted if it weren't for the fact that Fucking ghost type can't hit Ratata. Kill! Why can't you kill? It is the dumbest thing on the planet. Run. That makes no sense. It's obvious that Ratata can't attack a ghost type because it's just using Tail Whip all day. So why the hell can't? Ghost type hit Ratata. It is the normal type poster boy. It makes no sense. Is this another programming error? Did they do the thing like they did with the ghost type supposed to be super effective against psychic, but then they messed that? When you move, you can't escape. Ah! I'm gonna run you over with a tractor trailer, you little shit. Can't even level up my two low level Pokemon this way because Mud Slap is a shit move and ghost types can't hit normal! Well, actually, it's because I don't care. I don't care. Rattata is a normal type. It is the pinnacle normal type and ghost can't hit it for some reason. No excuses can matter here. Fuck off. Can I run the fuck away this time? 
Why? <laughs> Just let me leave, you fucking assholes. Uh, it's because I don't care. This game has thrown dumb stuff at me, one after another. I do not care. The ruins thing. Dumb, but I understand, and I'm partly to blame. There is no excuse for this ghost-type shenanigans going on here. None. Whatsoever. It still makes no sense. I'm, tr I'm, I'm trying to pick my own brain. You know, what would even make Ratata immune? Nothing. Nothing would make Ratata immune to ghost type. What even is- Oh, is it because Ratata's dark type or something? Is dark type immune to ghost? I'm trying to bungle the mind. Can, hey, can you mud slap this to death? It's gonna poison the togepi, isn't it? You poison the baby! Why is it such a shit move? Or is you are you just a shit Pokemon? I am so tilted. Ah, uh, ghost types can't hit. But I'm gonna harp on this for eternity because it makes no sense. Some things like the critical hit edition of Pokemon Yellow. That's just something to joke about really quickly because he he ha has. This makes no sense. None. Zero. Cilantro makes more sense as a typing than ghost type not being able to hit Radata. I already wasted a bunch of money and time on Pokeballs because, eh, once again, and I'm gonna harp on that too. Because screw that. It's such a stupid puzzle. They could have telegraphed it so easily, and they chose not to. Because they chose nachos. Don't use us. Like, I don't know. Like, hey, <laughs> that would have actually been funny if it was all you had to do was alter the text slightly and have it be escape R and then have flavor text that is like some is why have been uh, eroded by time. And that would have been like extra, but pe they probably thought, oh. People just use an escape rope. You know, at the same time that we have the alphabet Pokemon catchable. Because doesn't that make more sense in a way that you catch the six-letter Pokemon that you need to spell the six-letter word? Because you just got the six-letter thing, the, the letter Pokemon to start spawning? He's like, come on, that makes perfect sense. What doesn't make sense is the typing thing. Now and forever. Ghost should hit normal. Screw you. What is the decision? What is the methodology? Is it because it's not afraid of no ghost? Is that Ratata forever? It's all Ratata's Ghostbusters. What even? What even? Steven! But it's just like, our words will last through the ages or whatever the hell. I'm I'm tilted. I'm angry. The puzzle is stupid. And yeah, I'm guessing we need we have to wait for like uh, we'll go to the left up there, but let's talk to the people. I'm angry. The unknown catch will all be recorded. Check to see how many kinds. <laughs> I wonder how many kinds of Pokemon are in the ruins. Twenty-six, maybe. Maybe 28. The strange Pokemon you saw in the ruins? They appear to be very much like drawings on the walls here. Hmm, that must mean there are many kinds. I am so tilted. Tilted! Are you still gonna say, whoa? Ah, there's another huge hole. Yeah, and it's just like three things, some heal powders that I was too tilted to maybe to gobble gobbledygook. Oh, this is to... Really?
Huh. To Youth Decreet. Oh, let's see. I don't know. I don't know where to go. I'm, I'm, uh. Did you see that strange tree in the road? That must explain why fewer people are visiting the ruins of Alf. Don't you wonder who'd uh, make something like this and why? The ruins of Alf? Why, hey! I was going to snap with the, me straight arm punch, but I couldn't. I'm a failure. The real failure are the people who designed ghost moves to not hit normal types. I'm gonna harp on it for five million years because it came at the worst time. An odd tree is blocking the way to Goldenrod. It's preventing me from shopping. Something should be done about it. Why don't you try and kill it? Route 36. Oh. We're just back here. That's funny. Yep. We have to get the watering can. I'm still annoyed by that. I'm annoyed by all that transpired there. Mud slap is apparently a terrible move. Understandable, I guess. But I still will not accept ghost types not being able to hit. I should have put Sherry out here because then they could have attacked the hoot hoot and gotten super damaged. But oh well, we're not we're not gonna split the experience that much. Again, we already split the experience a lot because I thought that fucking ghost type would hit normals. It's not a two-way street. Normal attack can't fight ghost. Ghost can fight normal. Or is this just commentary that human beings are unaffected by ghosts? But then why do you explain the normal humans being possessed by the ghosts in the first game? Your methodology stinks. But yeah, we need to get Surf before we can do more of the ruins. Understandable, but still fuck you. Forever angry. Forever enraged. Me. Route 32. Pilot City to Azalea. Blah, 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 You don't want to fight? You have some good Pokemon there. It must be from the training you gave them around Violet City. The training at the gym must have been especially helpful. As a souvenir, Violet City, take this. It increases the power of Grass-type moves. Yeah. Your experiences in Violet City should be useful for your journey ahead. Yeah. Fight me, you little bitch. So you think you're pretty tough? I know I'm tough. I'm also angry. That means I'm double tough. Because you wouldn't like me when I'm angry, you poor, stupid child that hasn't slept. Oh, hey, look, the, the reason I can't use my, my, my ghost type, I can't use my ghost type because this is a normal type. It makes no sense. Ah! I will forever harp on it. I'm gonna, I will learn the harp and I will play this tune. This is a dumb decision. Ah! You ro lowered my defense. I'll lower your attack. I don't know how a how 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 how, uh, how a bird can growl, but at least that's more reasonable than <laughs> ghosts not being able to attack normal types. Die to a critical. Always die to a critical. Die again. I will. I will. I'll become a. I'll become a fucking. I'll become a fucking necromancer. Just to bring you back to, to, to life, so I can kill you again. The rage is unending. Anger unceasing. Sherry, can you hit this? It, it, maybe because this might be part dark type. I haven't caught a Zubat yet. Let's see. Oh, oh, you're that kind of jerk. Mm. Hypnosis. You missed. It shouldn't say that. It should say 
it missed. It shouldn't say it uh, isn't affected, because then it'll just be like, is it because it actually is type not affected, or is it because the move just missed? Which is it? I swear, if it's just like, oh yeah, it's unaffected, I'm gonna be so freaking angry. Yay, it worked! God, this is a shit move. The one-two punch. The ultimate one-two punches. Quit trying. I, I hate that, that miss. It's like, oh, it didn't affect. I get it. It's like, it used it, but it didn't affect the Pokemon in the moment. But from the metagame perspective, that sounds like it didn't act, it's unable to affect. That is what it reads like when you use that kind of language. It is unable to affect Sherry, not, it just missed. <laughs> In the actual world of Pokemon, it makes sense to say, oh, it didn't affect it. The effect did not take hold. But here, in the context of video game, saying it did not affect Sherry carries a different implicit meaning. <laughs> we got a critical hit to end it off. Yeah. And like, that's another thing. All of the unknown are level 5. Making me think that, oh, they want you to capture lots of them. Which I guess they kind of do, but come on. Uh, uh yeah, and you know, pardon battle, I'm on the phone. Oh, alright, but make it fast. Okay, I guess. Picnicker Liz. Ah, that's a nice animation. Dear God, it's level 9. At least this will be good for Owl. In the 100 acre wood Where Christopher Robin plays You'll find the enchanted neighborhood Of Christopher's childhood days a donkey named Eori is his friend, and Kanga and Little Roo, and Rabbit and Piglet, then there's Alm, and most of all Winnie and the Pooh. I had to calm myself down because the anger is still rising. <laughs> My anger, it's rising, it's overflowing! Booyah. Good job, Togepi. Metronome! That's probably better than frickin' Mudslap. Oh, I've got to relieve my anger. I think this is the first time that I found Repel in the wild. Time Metronome. I said Metronome. Please don't be explode. Well that's that's that was worthless. It's not worth anything if I can't murder him. 
That glance, it's intriguing. This glance, I'm murdering you. Togepi. Metronome. Dang it. Fine. Hot shot, or hot spot, kill. Hot spot the hot shot's gonna murder you dead. It's gonna murder you dead. Wet lasery, my poor Pokemon. Hmm, this is disappointing. You wanna know what else is disappointing? Me running you over and you not dying. Let's fight some fat dudes. My Pokemon freshly caught! Your Pokemon soon to be freshly dead. Oh wow, I already had that Pokemon. Uh... Metronome! I guess that, that that works. Use hyper beam. Thunderbolt works. It didn't even kill. Why didn't it kill? Oh, mud slap. No. Metronome! Metronome! Kill. 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 Oh! At least you can kill it with a mud slap. That's, that's really good. I'm gonna send out my ghost. Hopefully it will hit, because at this point I'm just going to assume that ghost can't hit anything. Oh! Then again... Profound sadness and anger and sadness and... Spite's a ghost type move, so that wouldn't even help me against the motherfuckers. Mm. Mm. Ah! I probably shouldn't have sent out Owl because it's low in health, but I'm not in a good headspace right now because of everything. I'm gonna use Flash. Why are you faster? Fuck you. Quite upset by these turn of events. Kill. K. 
kill. How dare you survive with one health? Then again, how dare that other one survive after getting hit by a thunderbolt? Really? That's the real crime. Hello, mother. How are you? I found a useful item shopping, so I bought it with your money. Sorry, it's in your PC. It better be like... a Master Ball. Hey, right, fuck it, I'm gonna head back to town. Meh. Totodile can be our guard back to town. As we heal up. Ah! Ah! Hello, Bell Sprout. You're a bitch. If I wasn't so weak. So weak. I would have sent out to hot spot to murderize you. Ah! I'm still not over the fact that ghost doesn't affect normal. Like, that's the entire point of ghosts. To be like, you can't touch me, but I can touch you. Mwahaha, <laughs> I'm an evil ghosty. Like, come on. It's, it's the entire point of ghosts. You can't take the entire point of ghosts and say no. Like, unless there is a very specific type reason that normals can't be touched. I refuse. I refuse. Oh, wow. Would you look at that? It's another motherfucker. Hotspot murder. At this rate, I think I'm going to replace Sherry first. Because the, the, now I'm just disappointed in all of it. In all everything. Should put Togepi back in. Nope. Uh, actually, what is the power of Mud Slap? 20. So I guess you just have terrible stats. Again, didn't even kill a water type with Thunderbolt from Metronome. <laughs> Cool, we found a great ball. It must be a real great ball. I found some good Pokemon in the grass. I think they'll do it for me. Now it's time for me to kick your ass. Stupid little boy. Hey, a whooper. Cool. Metronome. Keep up that barrage from Metronome. How dare you spit on my Togepi? For Togepi to never you Metronome. Metronome. Lol. Sadness. Big sadness. Metronome. Metronome. Dang it. Metronome. 
This is how I get my fun now. After pain and misery. No! Why does it only do so so little damage? It got freaking Aurora Beam. And it's just like, yeah, it doesn't do much damage. Come on, it's Aurora Beam. It's Metronome. Make it do damage. Screw you. Metronome. Metronome. Why do you have terrible stats, apparently? Come on! Metronome should do lots of damage when it gets things like Aurora Beam. Instead, it's just like, yeah, it's just... Uh, five. It's just disappointing. It almost feels like Metronome has its own attack power, and it just... <laughs> substitutes whatever, like, Aurora Beams is. It's just like, makes me sad. Makes me feel like my Potokpi is not really good. I'm really good at both fishing and Pokemon. I'm not about to lose to any kid. If Metronome would actually be a good, a good move, you could lose to a literal kid in Togepi. But no. Life isn't fair. And life is also not fair because this fucking thing knows freaking D. 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 A fish would know peck. But it does. Why are you just using tail whip a lot? Do you have dumb AI? Not the Super Sonic! I don't wanna play Sega! He's Pokemon! God damn it! Why did it do so much damage? Screw you! Peck is an air move. It's a bird move! Fuck off! That's right if you hit yourself. God damn it, owl! Fuck you! This is all bullshit. <laughs> Hypnosis! Because fuck you! And that will kill your bubbles. It probably won't do much, but I want to see what damage it'll be. Why don't you fucking no tackle, you stupid little tadpole? I'm just mostly annoyed. So annoyed. But this game makes no sense at times. Why does Ghost not affect normal? It's the dumbest decision to ever come down from the type dictator general. Togepi has terrible stats. Sherry can't be used for most things. Owl apparently has terrible stats too. Because just like, oh, I'm being pecked to death by a fish. How does a bird get pecked to death by a fish? How would you like to have this tasty, nutritious slowpoke tail? For you right now, just a million. It's the new bike. No. You don't want it? Then scram. Shoo. He's actually Nugget Bridge and 
the bike rounded together. Can't bite because it's too expensive. But at the same time, you actually had a choice to, jo <laughs> to, if, to say yes there. This is a great fishing spot. You saw people fishing. How about you? Would you like to one of my rods? Sure. Get another old rod. If there's water, be it the sea or stream, try out your rod. What should I... Maybe a, an item that increases attack power. I went too fast. Because my brain is turning to mush. What did I get? A super potion. That's actually not too bad. Actually, it's actually pretty good. That badge is from Violet City. You beat Falconer? I wish I could use Metronome to beat you, but the game says no. Because raisins. Raisins is why I can't Metronome you to death. Raisins. It's horrendous. Raisins. Listen, I get that Metronome can only uh, only has I get that Metronome only has 10 power points so that you can't spam Metronome and get uh potentially powerful moves again and again. But come on. <laughs> if it's not going to do decent damage when you get a decent move. Lol. That actually did decent damage. Continue on the metronome! Lol! One, one health. Metronome! Explosion. Disable! But it failed. And I don't want to use fucking potions. One more time! Medrinome! Yay! Or maybe not yay. Mud slap? This probably will miss because ground, but bleh. Why? Oh, yeah, it continues, yay. And it kills. Yay. That was not worth it. Ah! Let's try Sherry! Maybe you can hit the flying type! But it'll probably be like actually Pidgey's part, not so blah. <laughs> Why? What is the point of you? It's so stupid. It's so stupid. It's a ghost type. Let it hit Pokemon. Why would you let anybody catch ghost Pokemon if it can't fight the majority of what you're going to fucking run into? This early on! Fire that person! Go back in time! And the person that said, hey, we should put Ghastly in Sprout Tower! Go back in time and fire them! Right now! Out of a cannon! To the moon! So they can sit there and feel bad! Because it makes no sense! It makes no sense! And it will never make sense! It has to be another situation where they screwed up. Like Psychic being super effective against ghosts instead of being weak. I refuse. My cannon is better. Because it makes sense. And besides, Game Freak has history of messing up typings. So that just means I'm even extra writer. 
besides really it being a flying type should take precedent over it being normal type. Screw you. I know what, I know what my weaknesses are. Do you? My ghost type has been disappointing. Togepi has been disappointing. And I completely bungled the Alf Ruins puzzle. Even though I had the answer at the very beginning. Union Cave. It's Onion Cave. I think I will stop for now. Primarily because of all the chaos. All the madness. Madness! Madness. Sparta. Ah. Overall, still having lots of fun for this first time playing Crystal. Not sure if I've noticed any super differences besides the fact that there is animated sprites, which I think is unique to Crystal compared to Gold and Silver. And then, of course, the fact that you can choose to be a boy or a girl as series tradition has begun. Kind of funny that Professor Oak is the one to kick you off, despite the fact that it's Professor Birch who is the one giving you your Pokemon. That's kind of funny. <gasps> and yes, I am the one that completely bungled the Ruins of Alf beginning puzzle, but I will say it is a poor show to introduce the uh, unknown that quickly. The sliding puzzle should have been behind the escape rope door, is it, personally. Sure, it might... Like, maybe have someone mentioned, somebody once said they found a sliding tile puzzle once, but lost it and could never find it again. And then have people be like, oh, escape, escape rope, D. Instead of, oh, I found the alphabet Pokemon, and then this is a six-letter word. Obviously, I must have six alphabet letter Pokemon in my team in the proper order to spell the word. I overcomplicated it, yes. But come on. Later games use frickin' like... <laughs> use, I think, Braille. And then there's like the Pokemon that evolves when you hold the 3DS upside down. And then there's the... Feebas! I think there's a certain Pokemon, I think it's Feebas, in a later Pokemon game that can only be caught in very specific singular tiles that are randomly generated upon game generation. So you can't just say you overcomplicated it. Pokemon gets complicated. So why shouldn't it be... So why shouldn't it be actually a bit straightforward with spell out a word with the alphabet Pokemon? <laughs> Considering what later Pokemon games do, my little brain fart is generous to Pokemon. <laughs> but still, I'm dumb. I made a mistake there. I still think that ghost type should affect normal, though. Especially this early on. What's the point of giving the player a ghost Pokemon, especially giving the player ghost Pokemon before the normal flying type gym? Because <laughs> you could go to Sprout Tower, and Sprout Tower has basically, honestly, is probably a better place to go before the Falconer gym, because you can get more levels in, and they're generally lower level compared to Falconer, who's like, I think, or it's kind of the same, but... Still, they're interchangeable to a degree. So it's just extra hilarious that it's just like, you can catch Ghastly in there. And for the first time, you don't need the Sylph Scope. And then it just doesn't affect normal type, which is all the Falconer Gym has. That's just hilarious. Just hilarious. And super sad. Sherry is getting replaced as soon as I find a decent replacement Pokemon. <laughs> But anyway, I've been Neon Icy Wings. This has been Pokemon Crystal. I probably spent too much time in the Ruins of Alpha Edition. <laughs> and I hope to see you dudes next time. Bye. Bye.